From the Oklahoma studios, this is a Varsity Sports Update. I'm Cameron Jordan, and I'm here today with uh, Cam Backus from Edmond North. Cam is the uh, Oklahomans All-City Volleyball Player of the Year. Cam, thanks for coming in today. Yeah, no problem. So let's talk a little bit about your season. You guys won a Class 6A championship. You beat Broken Arrow in four sets. Uh, take me a little bit through the emotions of that match, because you lost the first set, and then were able to come back and, mm -hmm. and win the next three to win the championship. Honestly, throughout the entire match, I felt like the team, like, stayed pretty level-headed even though the emotions were high and like the energy was super high I feel like we all had the desire to win so much that the first loss just fired us up to come out even stronger in the next three sets. You mentioned losing that first set like only a couple weeks before you guys had gone to Broken Arrow and, and they beat you in three sets what did you learn from that match and even in the semifinals you beat Emma Memorial who you guys had lost to twice in five sets early in the year what did those match? What did those losses during the regular season? Did that give you that extra motivation when it comes state? Uh, yeah, for sure. And not only like the loss. Um, I don't even know. The loss definitely helped us to overcome. Um, just. Just kind of yeah. like that adversity, right? Yeah. And we reflected on it a lot. So everything in practice, um, everything we did in practice leading up to state was for that final moment of beating Broken Arrow in the finals. And Memorial is obviously one of our biggest rivals. So beating them in the semis, definitely, um, it was a really exciting match. So I know, I know you're a really dominant offensive player. You're really strong at the net. What, when did you learn that volleyball was going to be the sport for you? Like, how, how long have you been playing it? And when did you realize that it was a sport that you had the chance to play in college? So I started playing volleyball when I was 10 years old. I started off on the Oklahoma Peak 11 ones team. And when I made that team, I made this decision in my mind. I was like, one day I want to play Division I volleyball. And ever since then, everything I did was intentionally to reach that final goal. and. Obviously, I mean, I guess I reached it, but that's only the beginning for me, so. I was about to say, did you have any like, idols growing up? Like you say, when you, when you made that team, it kind of made your decision, like, I want to do this at the next level. Did you have any idols, volleyball players growing up, or just anyone who really pushed you to that goal? Well, somebody that I really looked up to um, at a young age was Hannah Rose Froling, and she is the same number as me, <laughs> and um, she's a very, very good player, and she goes to Pepperdine now. And um, when I was 11, 12, 13, I would always look up to her and watch how she played. And I was like, I want to be like that one day. So, yeah. You mentioned your goal at Division I. You accomplished that yesterday. You signed with Lipscomb University. Yep. Take me through the recruiting process and why did you decide to go there? Um, so it was a very long recruiting process. I started it when I was 14 years old. Um, the very first college that sent me anything was University of Washington, which is a obviously very big school. And so I went on a lot of visits, saw many different cultures, many different states, like all over. Um, and a few of those schools, for example, were University of Pittsburgh, Kansas State, Liberty University. Um, so very diverse. and. Um, it was very exciting. It was also very stressful because of the amount of people contacting me and wanting to be on the phone with me and like letters coming in the mail, um, but also very exciting. So the final decision, Lipscomb University, when I got on campus um, for my official visit, automatically felt like home. I didn't say it out loud, <laughs> but um, I knew it. And so, um, the community there, the culture there is just very different than um, anywhere else I had been. Obviously, they are Division One, so it's um, very competitive, exactly what I'm looking for. And um, it's also a Christian school, which I'm very, very big in my faith. And so it gave me the opportunity to pursue um, what I wanted to, a competitive atmosphere. Uh, surrounded by people who are like-minded so yeah so look looking back at this year obviously you're a state champion so you're, <laughs> you're gonna get a ring here soon but would you say that's your, been your favorite memory of your four years at Edmond North or is there something else that just really sticks out about your time there like what would you say is your favorite memory definitely definitely winning the state championship ending up on top but um, the past three years at state we had been out the first round so getting that far and com 
like accomplishing the goal that I had in mind all four years is definitely the top um, one. So <laughs> for sure. Hey, Cam, thanks for coming in. Really appreciate it. Yeah, thank you. That's Cam Backus. She's from Emma North. She is the Oklahoman's All City Volleyball Player of the Year. Make sure you stay tuned with all of our content at Oklahoman.com and every day in the Oklahoman.